Welcome everybody. Let's talk about the earthquake that hit California. California rocked by 5.4. Let me get a little bit bigger dot here. 5.4 earthquake as state battles life-threatening floods. Now you should know by the title of this this um, this video that I predicted that we would get an earthquake. Okay, they spend billions. You know, you know, what kind of frustrates me, guys and gals. Before we dive into this, they spend billions of dollars, you know, with these early earthquake warning systems that don't work. You know, only after you get an earthquake, then they say, "Oh my gosh, there's going to be a 7.0 in the aftershocks." You know, I mean, what good does that do? I'm not saying it's completely worthless, but it's just amazing how much tax dollars they waste on these ridiculous systems that don't really work very well. So I predicted, and you're going to see here in a moment, I predicted that there would be an earthquake. And I did that on Christmas Day. Let's just look at this article real quick and then we'll dive into the prediction. Uh, Northern California has been hit by 5.4 magnitude earthquake for the second time within a span of two weeks, leading to power outages and widespread damage. Yeah. The quake took place on New Year's Day, which basically was yesterday. Okay, today's the second, so it happened yesterday. Striking around nine miles southeast of Del Rio. This thing's kind of got a mind of its own here. I don't know why it keeps changing, but there it goes. South uh, Del Rio in Hol Humboldt County around 10.30 a.m. on Sunday. Okay. Yeah, pretty bad. 5.4 is bad enough. So um, you can see here, there's a little bit of little bit of video here. I'm not going to click on it, but you can see the video of the selfie video captures earthquake shaking home in Northern California. Yeah, yeah, look at that. I don't know what's going on with this thing. It keeps changing the size of the, but yeah. Shaky, shaky going on. Stuff on the floor, you know, just earthquakes are, are, are in, in many ways, earthquakes are way worse than hurricanes because you don't know they're going to come. At least with hurricanes, you, you know they're coming. Okay, let's go take a look at the prediction. Okay, so you can see here that uh, I made a, this is my Discord server, just a screenshot of my Discord server. Okay, you can see here on Christmas Day, 2.30 in the morning, I was up late, um, or I should say early, 2.30 in the morning. I was up early that Christmas morning uh, looking at some data. And I said here, so there's a fairly decent chance of a significant earthquake 6.0 or higher somewhere between December 28th and January 4th. Now, I know it was a 5.4, but my guess is, guys, that before we hit January 4th, we're going to have an earthquake. It may have already happened. Because uh, remember, earthquakes aren't, aren't reserved just for California, right? They can ha they happen all over the, all over the world. And I'll look at the earthquake data, but my guess is before we hit January 4th, we're going to get a 6.0 or higher. So there, there it is. There's a prediction. There's a time frame I thought it would happen. Um, like I said earlier in the video, you know, they spend billions of dollars on these these ridiculously um, early, these re horrible, I should say, uh, prediction or early warning systems for earthquakes that never get it right or hardly ever get it right. So at this point, you know, we live in a world today, guys, where, where um, there's a lot of things going on. And, you know, I have an algorithm and that looks at data and is able to approximate when we're going to get earthquakes. And when I mean when, uh, earthquakes, I mean 6.0 or higher normally. But I, I got to dive more into the data, but we'll, we'll, we'll get to that later, probably in a future video. Okay, but for right now... Um, Based on what I saw, I looked at the data for 2022. Okay, so approximately, um, it looks like uh, I can predict you know, within a few days when the earthquakes are gonna are gonna hit. So we have the time, right? We know the, uh, the time or the date of when, or we, I also call that the when. We have the when, okay? Um, we just don't know. I don't know yet the where. That's hard, much harder. The, the where is harder. Okay. Uh, so this is, you know, if, 
this is on my Discord server when I made this prediction. So by the way, if you want to join my membership, which is uh, for trading, uh, and I also think I'm going to implement an uh, earthquake warning system on this, this platform. But yeah, I have a, a trading service that I provide for members. So if you want to join that, it's $5.99 a month, super cheap. Just subscribe to this YouTube channel for now. Give me a thumbs up, appreciate that. And then click the join button below the video and you can join for $5.99. And what, what kind of service do I provide my members? Uh, I provide them access to the Discord server, which I give my opinion about where I think the stock market's going. Also, I track futures and some other things, uh, corporate bonds, some uh, fixed income. Um, I also send out, send out a nightly email I give my opinion about where I think the market's headed. And I, when I do make my trades, I share my trades usually, not all the time, but most of the time I share my trades with my members. Okay. And occasionally put out videos like I'm doing this one. Okay. This happens to be about earthquakes, uh, but I'm a software developer as my, you know, my day job. Um, obviously, I'm very involved with data. So I do a lot of data analysis as well, in addition to just writing software. So that's, you know, I kind of have the mind to, to do these things, okay? So if, you, if that sounds good to you and something you want to be, want to be a part of, um, join, okay? But anyway, getting back to the, the video here, I think what I'm going to do on the new, uh, if you want to register at my new website, you can. It's called getuscharts.com. Okay, I'll put that up on the screen here. So go to over to getcharts.com. For now, you can just going to register. I'm still rolling some things out on the website, but if you want to register there, you can. And the billing part will come later where you can actually pay for your monthly subscription. Okay. Um, but what I think I'm going to do, in addition to all of the services that I provide for traders, I'm also going to think, I'm gonna, when I hopefully get the time to do this, I'm going to provide a service for um, early earthquake warning. It'll put out, you know, my best estimation on using my algorithm to, you know, basically warn people that there's, there's a, a good chance, an increased chance of earthquakes within this certain date ranges like you're seeing here, like this prediction I did on Christmas Day. And it'll probably be, when I put those out, it'll be earthquakes that are, you know, around 6.0 or higher. That could change, but for now, that's, that's what's going on. Okay. Anyway, I wanted to share all this with everybody because this was... A pretty significant breakthrough right now. Um, you know, I look at the earthquake warning systems. They're just horrible. They, they're not accurate. These people don't know what they're doing. Um, it's, it, they're always kind of react, knee-jerk reacting after an earthquake rather than actually accurately predicting when. If I get time, I'll dive into seeing if we can figure out the where. Like I said, that's much harder. But for now, this is a, a pretty pretty big leap forward as far as predicting when earthquakes are going to happen. Yeah, it's not going to, you know, I'm not uh, predicting every little earthquake for, you know, smaller earthquakes for three, fours, and fives. You know, this is usually fairly significant earthquakes that are being predicted, okay? Okay, everybody, hope everybody had a really great Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. God bless all of you. Listen, guys and gals, love one another and forgive one another. We'll talk to you all real soon again next time.